Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Seattle Building with your uh, crazy builder Akiva. And uh, this is weekend Seattle Building, I believe. I don't know. I I record these ahead of time. Anyways, today uh, we are going to be going ahead and continuing work on the Ripper project. Uh, this is an SV that I have been working on for. I don't know how long. I'm not even going to take a stab at it. I started this sometime last year and I put it aside because I didn't need it at the moment and I wasn't going to use it and put it on the back burner. Anyways, I started again for the streaming. I want to get it done because I'm looking for a... How do I put this? A uh, 10 ox, 10 quant combat SV. So there's there's limits there there's there's quant limits and ox limits on servers and so uh, as well as turret limits and I wanted to yeah I wanted to uh, get it done so that the people that do do nah, excuse me do deal with turret limits um, they have something to to toy around with because I've been putting things with uh, ignoring quant limits and turret limits lately anyways just just playing to the just playing to the the crowd here and trying to make people happy and uh, yeah just thought I'd be a good human being today and make something for you guys that uh, works on servers such as Anvil and HWS without uh, without modifications and uh, being stripped down to nothing anyways uh, as you can see here we have had some work on this done I, I mean well, we did on the last stream anyways, or the last video anyways, uh, dealt with the wings here, thought about clipping them a little bit, which is what I'm going to be doing right now. I'm going to go ahead and clip, clip these just a little bit because, yep, go ahead and turn that one off. So I'm going to have to go ahead and destroy that or get rid of that, uh, get the wings on my inventory. Uh, Wing blocks, wing blocks, where are ya? Ah, just, alright, here we go. Uh, let's see here, let's get modular wings on here. I don't want swept wings, I want tapered, s no, that's tapered. Um, I want, uh, yeah, there we are. Those ones. Let's try this again. Ah, there we go. Now we are going to go ahead and copy this block here, that block, and that block. Do the same back there. See what I'm doing here, I imagine. Copy that turret. Get rid of it. Get rid of those blocks. Move it in. And put a minigun turret there. There we go. See, what I did there was just copy the orientation a little bit, and I have no idea if that actually helped anything, or if it was just uh, a fluke that it managed, that it decided to place where I wanted it to place. No idea. Don't care. Let's go. <laughs> Sometimes, just gotta thank the game for being, um, the game. <laughs> if that makes sense to some of you, I uh, pity you for playing in this game. No, 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 I'm just being silly now. Alright, let's go ahead and turn off the vertical symmetry and keep the horizontal. Horiz Did I just say horizontal? Oh, I need more tea. Yeah, probably not a good, good idea considering how late it is at, at night. Uh, right, we are not going to be working on the bottom today. We need to work on the top. Well, I mean, I might work on it later. Might help if I uh, get the block I want back. Let's go ahead and do copy textures. There we go. Make sure all these blocks are copying the proper texture.
And I just realized I spent all that time copying textures, and I was like, um, yeah, let's not. Okay, anyways. Let's move the sun out of the way, shall we, so it's not blinding me. Come on, sun. Cooperate with me. Okay, there we go. That's acceptable. No, that's not. Okay, let's just work on it from this side. I wish I could just turn off the sun but keep the illumination. But uh, that would be too easy, wouldn't it? I should have known I wasn't going to stick to that shaping. It's fine. I just wanted to test to see how it looked, and I didn't like it as I thought I wouldn't, but sometimes you just got to test it and, and try it out and see. I suppose I could use these as heavies, but, um, to be honest, I, I, I don't want to put heavies on this for most of the, I mean, I'll do, well, what's the ammo like? The, the heavy minigun turret ammo is pretty light. The heavy plasma turrets ammo is, is not as heavy as it could be, but it is, um, yeah, I, I, yeah, let's not. Let's just not do heavies. If they if they want heavies on their ship, uh, on the SV, they can put heavies on it. But, I mean, I'll put heavy SV lasers here because they're, um... 
because it's a decision that I'm making, but wow, that was great dodge there. Um, great rationality dodge there. <laughs> um, just give me a minute to collect my thoughts, please. Thank you. <laughs> uh, gosh, I'm so horrible at this. Classic. Anyways, uh, do, 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 that that landing pad is not gonna work there, is it? Okay, I mean that landing gear isn't gonna work there. Well, so be it. Um, you know what, landing gear, I can deal with that later. Uh, I wonder if. I mean, I could do that. Oh, screw it. We'll, we'll just put landing gear there now, just to remind myself that it's somewhere. Um, page down. Is that going to go down past the... Yeah, that'll that works. Okay. Look, as long as I have it in there to remind myself, I'm completely fine. Anyways, uh... I seem to remember an issue with laser turrets recently where they will shoot at themselves. And so I'm not gonna. I mean, they'll shoot you through at your own ship if you're not careful. So um, I'm I'm gonna leave them off and let it leave it to the the player to add them. You know, because I just don't want to add them. Um, I'd rather do manual fire weapons as the laser ammo. I mean, I can always change it up later when I'm ready, but in, in the meantime, I'm, I'm not going to worry about it. What are you doing here, Akiva? Oh, just being insane in the membrane. Don't worry about it. Yeah, I didn't think so. Undo, 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 undo. I want to see something real quick. No, I didn't think so.
I am quite pleased with that myself. Uh, quite pleased with that. Uh, Just getting a feel for the thing, don't worry about it. <laughs> Sorry about the, the camera going wild there for a second. I was just trying to get an idea of what, what I'm looking at, if you know what I mean. Um, just trying to get a look at it, and it's just, it's, it's good. Uh, I like it. It's just... Uh, you know what? I think that's fine. The way it was was fine. Oh, no, never mind. Um... Ah, you know what? I, I, I'm fine with it. Okay, so I need to copy that block, destroy it, and replace it with that block. One less thing I have to texture later. Now it just did occur to me that I could just do, instead of doing that, I could just do a very, very simple. Because the only point of that is to, to keep it from, just keep it from glowing, you know? That's the only point of that block there, is just to keep it from glowing. I mean on the front. I, I can keep it as is on the back because it's... Yeah, it, it is the way it is on the back. I don't know what I was thinking there, but okay. Just put that there, it's fine.
I'm gonna leave that one as is because I don't I I don't really know what I'm gonna be doing with it at the moment so I'm just going to leave it as is and uh, that shaping behind it as is because I might have something else I might do something else there Come on, copy what I want you to copy.
All right, so you might be thinking, what the heck are you doing putting a freaking generator next to a, a thruster? Well, the thinking is, and this is probably a little insane, is that if you're taking damage, why are you, I don't know, whatever. The thinking is that if you're in an SV and these generators are taking damage, then yeah, something's gone horribly, horribly wrong. And if these gener if this thruster back here is taking damage, then something's gone wrong. I mean, like really wrong. And yes, I'm getting rid of that that thruster there for a minute. Um, anyways, yeah, it, it, if if those things are taking damage, you, you you've done something wrong. Something's gone horribly wrong, and and it's not great. Hopefully that did what I wanted on the other side. Yes, it did. Good, good, good. I want those little exhaust ports to, to be visible because they are... It, it's just a little something neat to do. So the jet boosters back here, or the, the medium jet boosters back here, they're the side-to-side uh, -side torque jet boosters. Um, they're the side-to-side -side torque. And uh, I have them further back here because I just want them as far back from the center of mass as possible. So if I take on debug shows uh, center of mass, center of mass is right there right there where that blue one is and this is behind and this is ahead of those thrusters now that's likely to change a little bit but I don't think it's gonna change too much Come on, place where I want you. Oh, come on. Thank you. Of course you decided to place there, because why not?
Get near get near slots. Oh, that's the wrong model. Okay. I want jet boosters, not thrusters. over CPU again. Um, the reason I'm over CPU is because I was testing this. Um, yeah, that's full CPU. Well, that's not great. Uh, what am I missing here? Oh, well, I'll deal with the CPU in a bit. Um, I have a feeling I know what's going on there. It's just I've got to deal with it is all. Uh, whatever. Ah, we need to start thinking about... Or I need to start thinking about... Uh, shield goes in there. Of course that needs to go back in. Uh, Pentax tank, I'm not 100% sure I have it in there. We are going to go with the medium shield generator, which is standard shield generator, I guess. Now, because the shield is not targetable, I'm going to copy the improved extender. Turn off symmetry plane. Please don't tell me you got rid of the warp drive. You didn't. Okay, good. And put the improved extenders here. You have your O2 station there. Along with one on the, the top of the ship as well. Let's get rid of one of the advanced and put it Gives a whole new meaning to wipe your feet if I do put it there. I don't think I will put it there. Let's go ahead and leave that there for the moment. Uh, I'm 
I'm gonna take off a turret here, uh, some of the turrets because I don't need them. Um, let's take off these back ones for the moment. Should get me a little bit of CPU back. Uh, not nearly enough. Plasma, maybe? Oh yeah, that pl those plasma turrets take up a lot. That's fine. So, the back plasma turrets, I'm just going to turn on symmetry plane so I don't have to deal with them that way. Yay, another problem I need to fix. Whatever. Um... All right, it's got the bank shield on. Um, it's going to be tight on CPU, but that's fine. Um, So the reason I use plasma turrets is because they absolutely destroy anything that they hit. I mean absolutely destroy it. So if you get a, a like attack pass um, or if you, you go in straight at something, then these plasma turrets will be firing on it the entire time. And they absolutely freaking destroy it. Whatever it is they destroy shields, blocks, whatever. But they are absolutely CPU intensive for some bloody reason. I mean, they're they're quite a pain to use, but uh, and they're not very practical on when you're maneuvering, but eh, whatever. All right, CPUs in the in the decent area. Good. Uh, that's one less thing I need to worry about. Let's turn symmetry back off, I guess. Get that off my hotbar. Uh, now I need to check to see if this thing has a Pentaxa tank. I'm just gonna auto group. I I know I don't. I hate to auto group, but it is what it is. Um, turrets don't care. Warp, just a jump drive. What about in defense? <laughs> yeah, that's why I thought there's no Pentaxa tank in it. So I need to install a Pentaxa tank. So let's turn off symmetry plane because we're gonna be working on the innards. I could put it behind it, I guess, but I'm not going to worry about that. Okay, I'm just going to put the Pataxa tank back here. Because it's a reminder to me to put it in the ship. Just going to put it there. How many quants does this thing have? Oh, I haven't installed any quantums yet. Oh, okay. Well, CPU might not be a pain in the butt after all. Um, I'll just do a base 10 ox loadout to start with, and then players can upgrade it to what they want um, with more quants. Alright, uh, let's see here. What do we want to do on the insides? This is where I always get stuck is on the insides. So I've got oxygen 
O2 station there. Now I want to try something. God mode off. I mean, it's not that hard to get past that, so... Well, I mean, now that I think it got in there, it's not that hard, and it keeps you from going forward, but you can still access all the stuff. I mean, ideally what I'd like to do is uh, move the core somewhere off to the side. And the O2 off somewhere to the side so that it's not... Um, it's not so annoying. Because you kind of have to jump around to get around. And I really don't like that. That and if you're on a planet that... Um, if you're on a planet and you land a little bit wonky, you might not be able to get out. So, yeah, let's let's not do that. Um, let's move this back a little ways. Might help if I had symmetry plane on. Come on. There we go. start digging into these container extensions
That's such an ugly outline. Uh, let's see. That just leaves room for, that just leaves me needing to make room for the quantums and the, and the aux cores. So, um, alright, that is it for today. Uh, thank you for watching. I know I have been on a little bit low energy and I apologize. It's just been a long day and, uh, kind of just focusing on building today so uh thank you for watching i hope that you have a wonderful day remember to be kind to your fellow humans um treat others the way you want to be treated uh try and keep the snide and snarky responses to people to a minimum you know those responses that you do because you know you're gonna either gonna get a rise out of someone from it or or you just don't like the person and so you're a little bit more in their face than you would be otherwise just try and keep that to a minimum and and try and work on doing that less and less I know it's hard I, I struggle with it every day but remember just keep trying to be better make the world a better place uh, I hope to see you guys next time if you think I deserve if you enjoyed my content you think I deserve a like or 
or a subscribe please consider consider doing so it, it really helps me out and it helps me get seen by the youtube algorithm i i'm sure you already know this you're watching youtube um big thank you to my patrons uh you guys help me help me keep going with this content and uh help me improve it and besides you get something in return you you, you get uh there's a whole bunch of merch that you get in return and you get your name and lights thank you again have a good day banshee out